In order to use the Document Understanding Service, you're going to need to set up policies. The way you can do this is by logging into uh, the OCI console and clicking on the hamburger menu to the upper left-hand screen. Go under Identity and Security, and then click Policies. To start creating your policies, click the Create Policy button. The first thing you're going to want to do is make sure that you're setting your uh, policies at the root compartment level. As you can see right now, I'm in a compartment of this tenancy, um, so I'm going to change that now. You're going to want to name your policies. You'll add a description. And to set up these policies, you're going to toggle the button on to show manual editor. Now, at this point, you'll want to copy and paste some policies that we have documented um, in the document understanding policies page. So there's three core policies that you're going to be copying and pasting from. The first one here is uh, granting managed permiss permissions to the document understanding APIs. The second one is policy to access input image files from object storage. And the third one is to store your results in object storage. So for each of these policies here, um, you'll define the group in your tenancy that you want to give these rights to. So if you have a group for example, that you've already set up that's called document users. You could add that in there. And then all you need to do is replace that in these sections here. This last policy statement uh, requires you basically to uh, specify which compartment you want to give manage access so that the results from document understanding service can be stored in object storage. So in this case, I want my results stored in my compartment. So it's called Kdrazio demos and I fill it in here. Once you're done with all of those statements, you can click create and that will set up your policies for OCI document understanding service.